Another major development happening this morning. Roy McGrath, the fugitive ex-chief of staff for former Maryland Governor Larry Hogan, has died. He was shot during an arrest in Tennessee. Fox 5's Maureen Ume is live with details on this. Mo, good morning. Good morning. Uh, FBI officials confirming to Fox 5 that they did, in fact, find Roy, Roy McGrath in the Knoxville area. Around 6.30 yesterday, he was shot by an FBI agent and then went to the hospital where he later died. The FBI did release a statement about the shooting saying this. They said the FBI takes all shooting incidents involving our agents or task force members seriously. In accordance with the FBI policy, the shooting incident is under investigation by the FBI's inspection division. Now, 53-year-old Roy McGrath was indicted in October 2021. He's accused of stealing more than $275,000 from the state government, falsifying documents, and other criminal activity. McGrath was wanted on charges of failure to appear after missing his federal fraud trial and had been on the run since March 13th. Now, in the wake of his death, McGrath's attorney, Joseph Murtha, issued a statement saying this, It is a tragic ending to the past three weeks of uncertainty. I think it's important for me to stress that Roy never wavered about his innocence. Former Governor Larry Hogan also reacting to the death he issued a statement saying that he and his wife Yumi were saddened by what had happened and also praying for McGrath's family and loved ones. Uh, the FBI saying this investigation into McGrath's death will continue. Back to you.